19-year-old man is sentenced to nine years in prison for murder. Vaxjo District Court has announced the verdict regarding the murder that was committed in the Arabe area on September 11, 2021. Two people have been charged, an 18-year-old and a 19-year-old. The district court sentences the 19-year-old for murder to nine years in prison. The 18-year-old is fully acquitted. On the night of September 11, 2021, a 28-year-old man was on his way home to Arabe in Vaxjo. He was in the company with a friend. Two masked people drove up to him on an electric scooter. One of the men jumped off the electric scooter and shot him at close range with five shots from a pistol. The perpetrators then left the scene on the electric scooter. The man been shot died at the scene. An extensive police investigation has been carried out and several people have been suspected of involvement in the murder. Charges were eventually brought against two men, an 18-year-old and a 19-year-old. The evidence in the case consisted, among other things, in the testimony of the comrade of the shot. He observed the course of events from 15, 20 meters away. He has singled out the two accused men. In addition, other witnesses have been heard who, among other things, have made observations of the perpetrators when they left the scene. However, no other witness has identified the accused. In addition to information from witnesses, DNA from the 19-year-old has been found on a cartridge that was found with the shot and that was in the murder weapon. The prosecutor has also relied on a note that the 19-year-old wrote in custody. It has been addressed to his friends. There he has written that the friend of the victim that been shot and killed with whom he accompanied during the incident must be silenced, so that he can't talk because he was the only witness on the scene otherwise it is goodbye for him and another person. During a routine search at the detention center in October, a note was found in the 19-year-old murder suspect sock. The message was immediately interpreted as a death threat by the detention staff. Turn off the lights, you have until November 25th, the note says. Messages on the note are directly interpreted as a death threat directed at the main witness in the preliminary investigation and are confiscated. Turn off the shoe note so he doesn't keep singing. Otherwise, it's goodbye for me, says the note, which is addressed to the boys. Then the message continues with, park in his area or in front of his home. There have also been Google searches on the 19-year-old's mobile phone, a few weeks before the murder, for ammunition of the same type that was used in the murder. Both of the defendants had access to an apartment in the area to which the perpetrators likely took refuge after the murder. It is also clear that the murder weapon, at the time of the murder, was in the group of people to which the two defendants belonged. They also had access to an electric scooter during the evening and earlier in the evening. They were in a car on Stortigit in Vaxjo under conditions that indicate that they had spied on the man who was shot to death a few hours later. The 28-year-old man felt anxious after watching a rap video that he felt was about how he would be harmed. The victim's wife has also testified that the 28-year-old told her that the song was about hurting him and that he therefore felt worried, the court writes in its verdict. The district court has, as far as the 19-year-old is concerned, concluded that it is beyond reasonable doubt that he is one of the perpetrators. He is therefore convicted of murder. The district court finds that the murder was preceded by some planning and it was a question of a pure execution. The sentence has been set at nine years in prison. When determining the length of the sentence, the district court took into account the manse was only 18 years old at the time of the crime. The 19-year-old must also pay damages totaling just over 160,000 Swedish kroner to the shopman's wife and son as well as to the estate. In the case of the 18-year-old, the district court does not consider that the evidence is sufficient for a conviction. The identification of him by the comrade of the shot is not sufficient alone. The rest of the evidence against him is weaker than against the 19-year-old. Although there is other evidence that the 18-year-old was involved in the murder, it cannot be ruled out that the perpetrator is someone else. Point one. But the rapper claims he doesn't know the murdered 28-year-old and that the lyrics are completely fictitious. No one has more importance or no importance than